The job market's performing very well. Uh, we've had a very strong start to 2013, particularly in terms of the permanent market. We're probably seeing 10 to 15 percent more permanent roles than we did at the tail end of last year. I think employees will look to make decisions at this time of year. It's, a, it's the classic New Year's resolution. The findings in our salary survey is showing that less than half of the people are satisfied in their current roles, which therefore that creates a little bit of um, a little bit of fluidity to the candidate market, and people are more likely to make that move. It was interesting to find that eight out of ten employers are concerned about losing talent, um, which again does tie in a little bit with the increase in salaries and the fact that they are going up. Um, but it was also interesting to find that 43% um, felt they had a skills gap, which is down actually on previous years. I think the key trends for 2013 will continue to be in and around probably mobile and handheld um, devices. I think we're seeing no signs of that abating at the moment. It's um, particularly in the retail market where we're seeing the high streets under pressure and everything's moving online. So we are seeing a real drive towards that. There will be a move towards virtualization. I think there's been a, a little bit of cynicism around, around the cloud and, and concerns over security, but we are seeing more virtualization type roles coming in. Um, I think there will continue to be a trend towards clients wanting immediate impact from the people they hire. We saw last year, and I think we'll see this year, clients are willing to pay a little more for uh, um, experienced professionals to come in and make that immediate impact because such is the, the need to get technology to drive savings and efficiencies across their business. Um, I think we will also see a continued drive on big data. Uh, it's something which is a hot topic at the moment. I think in terms of skills that will be in demand, I think we'll still see a real drive towards the handheld apps. So we're going to see people with experience of the platforms, the main three platforms for handheld, so Android, iOS, which is the Apple operating system, and Windows 8. I think we'll also see a demand for people with the development skills that go with those. If you are an employee, it may make you decide whether to, uh, to make that move. We're seeing now candidates are moving a little more freely and will consider opportunities where before there was a fear over making that move. From an employer point of view, similar in as much as it will show what the market's doing in terms of paying, what, what you would need to pay to attract new staff, uh, but it also does show patterns over increases in salaries to retain the best staff. Uh, it also gives a good insight into the mindset of the employee. So obviously we've we've done research on the mindset of the candidate and whether they would move and how secure they feel in their roles. And it also will get people thinking about what they need to do to retain them in terms of flexible working, development and training to make sure they don't lose their best talent.